Hey folks, I'm going to show you real quick how to get the USB audio stream to come out of your Yamaha MG12XU mixer and into PreSonus Studio One. So make sure that you've got Studio One installed on your computer and also go over to uh, Yamaha's website and download the Yamaha Steinberg USB driver and make sure that is installed as well. After you've got both of those installed, when you launch Studio One here on the initial kind of startup splash page, you'll see this little setup panel here. And if you click on the device, it will open up the options pane here. And under audio setup, audio device, you should see a drop down menu right there. And that'll have all your different audio devices that you've got there. And you want to make sure you select the Yamaha Steinberg USB. And you can also click on the control panel for that. And that control panel is pretty handy if you have multiple Yamaha devices. Like here, we've got the MX keyboard. Uh, you can select, well, this one's only got a uh, single uh, frequency rate, but the MGXU mixer has uh, variable frequencies, so you can select your frequency there. Um, you can also go in and control the, um, the latency options and uh, buffer size. So that's pretty much about all you've got to do there. And if you fire up a new project or open an existing project, you should be able to, um, under the track, input drop down menu you should be able to see uh, channel one and two stereo for the mgxu or the channel one mono channel two mono there and that's about it should be all set